guys, it's MJ from Endless RVing. Are you tired of dirty RV carpet? We have something that works, and we're gonna show you. All right, guys, so if you missed our last attempt at getting a clean carpet, we're gonna link that right up here for you. Uh, we had purchased a, a Bissell pet stain eraser, and we have a video of that where Izzy, we used it, and Izzy was, Oh, it was hysterical. Just go watch the video. Anyway, we found something that finally works. So this is the uh, Hoover Smart Wash Plus Automatic Carpet Cleaner, and it does a great job. So we're gonna have Izzy take you through step by step and show uh, show you what he does to make this beautiful carpet clean. All right, guys. So we're back. Take two on cleaning the RV carpets. So the last one we did live. This one I already tried out. I know it works. This thing is awesome, and I'm just gonna get right into it why it's awesome, okay? First of all, price point. This is $199, okay? Not the cheapest thing out there, but certainly not your commercial grade, so not super expensive, probably pays for itself in about three carpet cleaning rentals, okay? So, let's get right into it. You have, I believe this is a one gallon water reservoir, okay? You're gonna fill that with warm water. And just so you know what comes out of the box, what comes in the box, you're going to have the unit and your it comes with a little cleaner and then it's going to come with a actual hose kit, a little bag with a hose kit with a hose attachment and this is going to be used to uh, clean your you know steps and stuff places where this can't get into. So let's continue with the actual unit itself, okay? What I do like about this, it's very easy to clean, right? So this is going to be your reservoir for your dirty water. So to clean this out, uh, we're clean right now, you're going to just simply pull it out, right? Then this little lever goes up, you open this up, you have a screen in there, you dump everything out. Very simple to clean, guys. Very simple to put back together, all right? Your hose attachment goes right here, okay? That's if you want to use that hose that I just showed you. Now, let's go to the back side. This is where you're gonna have your solution. All right, that's already filled up with solution. We are using Hoover Free and Clean Solution. Now, what I will tell you is that this, I believe, is half a gallon. I'm sorry, it's 50 ounces. This will probably get you, at least on ours, um, at least three of the fresh water fills. You'll probably get at least three or four before you have to buy a new solution. The solution's about 20 bucks. You have on the back here, easy coiling of your power cord, handle release, which will bring this back and forth. Then you have your power here, okay? Let's go underneath. And this is also what makes this very nice, all right? So to clean these bristles, this part just actually opens up. This easily comes up comes off and then these come up and you could take the bristles right out. I'm not gonna do it, but you could take these bristles right out. Super easy to clean, guys. Let me get this back together and then I'm gonna show you exactly how this works. All right, so we are in the bedroom where we have most of the carpet. This is the crux of my hatred for carpet. So you might be asking yourself, why did I choose, why did we choose this specific model? Okay, so a couple of reasons. A price point, as I mentioned, 199. B, it's supposedly automatic uh, smart steamer. What does that mean? Okay, so normally on steamers, you have to manually like press a trigger and release the solution, and then pull back, and you know it, it suctions it, right? What happens with that is sometimes you wind up using way more solution than you need to. All right, this unit it does it automatically. So when you push the unit forward. The bristles that I showed you before will spin. It will release the solution. When you pull the unit back, the bristle stops spinning. It sucks up the solution. However, there is also a dry only mode, okay? And in the dry only mode, there's a button here. You will hit this button, dry only mode. And what that does, it allows you to dry on both passes. What do I mean by that? So now when this is activated, when you go forward, it will only do suction. It will also use those bristles, but it will not release the solution. When you pull back, 
it will also just do suction and it does it with heat so it allows you to pull the solution out faster and it allows things to dry quicker now we've already used this once this carpet has been cleaned i'm just going to do it again for demonstration purposes i'm imagining we may get some uh some more dirt out but it's certainly not going to be as dramatic as it was before so just follow along and we'll take you through step by step all right for the moment of truth so what we're going to do is we are going to hit the handle release bring the handle down okay it's going to get a little noisy in here the first pass is going to be traditional forward it's going to release the solution backwards is going to do some suction mj is going to try to capture this as best as possible okay so let's power it on <laughs> All right, so you guys saw how it works in the traditional mode. Now, I'm gonna use it in dry mode. Remember, dry mode, it will uh, not spit out solution both forward and back. It's just gonna use suction and heat so it could dry this carpet up a little, a little quicker. So I'm gonna quickly demonstrate that and we'll get right back with you. Right, we are finished up using the actual unit itself I want to quickly demonstrate how the handheld hose works okay so it's gonna come with two different types of brushes it's gonna come with this rubber brush I don't really know what that's for but it's easy you can just like swap it out as such but I'm just gonna use the regular like nylon brush the other thing I wanted to show you this is very easy to clean the top here you just push this little button this pops out you can get anything out of like hair or anything and then to put it back in, you just go in and clicks in. Okay, so how this is gonna work, there is an inlet right here. You are gonna plug this in as such. It's gonna click, okay? Then you're gonna turn the unit on uh, just as you would regularly, and you're gonna have to manually release the fluid and it's gonna be with this trigger, okay? You release it, suck it down, we'll go through it. All right, guys, we are finished up with the bedroom now. Just keep in mind, this is the second run we did on this, okay? We did a full steam cleaning. Uh, first time not on camera, we wanted to test this out. So we just did the bedroom this time. Okay, so let me show you a couple things. So you can see how much water we used. Okay, it's probably about a quarter. But what's more important, like water is pretty much free, right? Look how much solution we have left. And I'm spilling it there, but it barely used solution. So this is where I think uh, something like this is really worth it because that solution is 20 bucks for 50 ounces. And look how little we use. So we can get this coach done probably, the whole coach done twice on one container and one little fill here. And that container probably has four or five fills of that container that's on uh, the vacuum, on the steamer. So like I said, second run, just a bedroom. Let us pull the collection dun, out dun, da, da, da. all right and guys this once again it's not as bad as before before this was this was nasty this was black it's still a little brown there's definitely a lot less hair we pulled out <laughs> this is why i hate carpet <laughs> this is why we don't have any carpet in our home but unfortunately on the motorhome it comes with carpet so guys i hope you enjoyed the video i hope you enjoyed the demonstration I would recommend this. This works really well and it is idiot proof. I could use it. You're up and running in less than five minutes. If you know anybody that has an RV that has nasty carpets or just has carpets in general, feel free to share this below. Also, we are going to put our Amazon affiliate link below with this machine. And if you have a technique that you use to clean your carpets, we want to know, right? I'm sure our subscribers will want to know. Finally, on our left, we are going to link our RV DIY playlist as well as our RV tour playlist. So for myself and MJ, we thank you guys for watching and we'll see you on the road.